back with the Plan Life documentary. Um, did say I was gonna have another plant um, by this time, but you know, you know how bills eat you up and stuff. So I was like, ah, forget it. I do have some clippings that I need to do. I'm gonna do some clippings real quick. You know, chat it up back with, with y'all. I ain't, ain't uploaded in a minute. Very long time. Dead leaves is what brings all those it's annoying pests. So make sure I definitely uh, cut this. Definitely cut it. Definitely cut all the dead. All the dead ends. So yeah, so um, I was gonna be uploading daily, but I was like, eh. nah, <laughs> nah. I kind of got busy with a whole bunch of stuff. I was thinking I was gonna be up, having the energy to upload every day. Yeah, it's difficult. Some days I get in this. This crib, like, man, I don't want to say nothing. Just want to get in my bed. You no know, time to play. Can I tear it off? Can I? Can I? Okay, so I usually water them. I have them in here for about an hour. I don't know why I have them about an hour. I might need to cut it down like 30 minutes or something like that, just to see, you know. They really dry though, they really dry. Really dry, really dry. Cause I ain't, um, I ain't watered them in, um, it's been a couple weeks, so. It's relatively light. I ain't got no, no other plants in it. I mean, not no other plants in it, but no water in it, not holding anything. Make sure I can get all these leaves in the pile because if you leave these leaves out, a lot of pests are just going to... Just going to try to run through it. You know. Some of these leaves get so small. Ready yet? Okay. Cool. I don't know how long I'm gonna look at it. I'm just look at it, man. Just, just think about life, man. I just got done with a workout. Some results. Oh my, why is it? Stay in there. Results come out so slow. It's like when you look up and just look, just look up and just after grinding for so long, just having your mind fixated on something else, you'll see changes happen in your life. Sometimes I get into that zone, you know, different things, you know, I'm on the game, at work basketball, all that. You just look up and see, you know, dang, I just did that. Look at how the time goes by. I feel like the key to, li key to life is being able to manage that zone, being able to get in and out of it because you're in that zone for too, for too long. You're in that zone for too long. I feel like um, you miss out on the things that's happening around you family, things that's really important, health, you know, when you, 
you gotta be able to turn it on and turn it off when you need to. Um, yeah, cause, and if it's, you know, you're not in the zone like you should be, not on top of your business. I feel like you gotta have a good balance of that. Maintain your emotions when you get into the zone, when you achieve success and everything like that. It really all just like, it takes focus on yourself, knowing yourself, knowing your goals, what you'll do to achieve it. Man, we started out. We started out kind of funny. I ate some eggs. Yeah, some salmonella. So, just tend to that. I was at work looking up all type of stuff. You know, when you get a little, little medical issue, you just think like, oh man, it's the end for me. Thinking I had a, an appendix that was swollen and ready to bust and stuff like that. I could, I could, but you know, it's pretty. Oh, oh God, just you know, get my stomach right. You know, you gotta get my get my organs right. Some organs is right there, right there next to you. It's like everybody's weak spot is the organs, like the intestines, because. It's just like a whole glob of, of guts. When you think about guts, really, they're like a whole lot of paths. They're kind of like the path to success. When you look at all of them at once, all of the pathways at once, when you look at all the organs, like say you, you cut open a dead body, you look at all them organs at once, you'll be like, bro, what is this? How, how, does, how does food get to where it needs to go? What is the pathway? So coming out of high school, I looked at everything like that. It was like, what's the way, you know, to achieve what I want to achieve? But until you figure yourself out and write things down and break down what exactly it is that you want to do and how you're going to do it, what's your five-year plan, what's your 10-year plan, it's going to be looking jumbled up for you until then. Until you break down, uh, this is the uh, digestive system, this is the central nervous system, this is the immune system, you know, things like that. And it's like all the paths is, you know, I would say it's your plan A, plan B, plan C. It could be, I don't know. I'm still thinking, I'm not saying it's your, you know, your multiple springs, spring, streams of income, but it could be if you're thinking about it in another way like they're like tools that you need to use to survive and thrive in this world um so once you find that pathway and still like the regular human body is still um viruses that can get in your way um you know doubt Um, bad influences in your life, um, you know, these struggles that you have to overcome to get where you need to go to be able to function. Because you know people going to try you. Your, your own people going to try you. In this world, it's, it's status that you have around even your friends your most trusted people is always going to be status and they're always going to try you 
it may be as in like grained into the human the human mind like to try your the people that's closest to you to see what they're made of see what they're built like I feel like it's just human nature that the person next to me needs to be ready for whatever that whatever I'm ready ready for so you always have to be ready for that watch your friends you know understand how they think understand that you're your own person and you have your own goals at the end of the day, of the day. Um, I feel like being your own person is really important feel that in like 15 minutes. I feel like yeah, because after, after I get done water needs for about 15 minutes, I'm going to just switch the other one out. But I'll end the video before that. I don't want to make it too long. Be a long, long up the upload date. Being yourself is really important though confidence in yourself is really important for like you you are the main driver towards your success if you don't think that you're gonna make this layup <laughs> you're gonna miss that layup if you don't think that shot going in you're gonna miss that shot same with anything if you don't believe in yourself you don't have that confidence it's this different type of energy that you bring to whatever that you do in life when you believe in it, when, you, when you're confident in it. It's a different type of energy. It's a different type of care. Another thing I do is manage your expectations as well. I feel like hope for the best, but Prepare for the worst is a pretty good analogy. You need to keep in mind that you know you hope you hope that it goes far, but prepare for you know the consequences of your path or whatever you're going through. Understand that life ain't cut and dry as you know what you do and that the world does revolve around you. That other people have lives going on. I don't think the water went down at all, but it's getting watered though. These these specific plants, they I guess they don't like uh, the water on the leaves as much because I, at first I was watering them pretty good. Um, I need to give them some more sunlight. I think I don't know. I'm gonna try this this month. Gonna be like without sunlight. Um, so yeah, and the place that I'm in, you know, we in Mississippi, in Greenville, Mississippi, does not have the best water. Um, I mean, when I spread out some, some water from my tub at first, it was like brown until it got like clear, so. And they say that, um, I researched that tap root, I mean, not tap root, oh my, this is not Skyrim. Tap water has um, things that make the plants go brown. And I want to keep my drinking water for myself um, to drink with and to cook with. So, um, plants get the dirty end of the stick. That's how it be. But yeah, imagine. Managing expectations is really important. Um, but yeah, but at the end of the day, if you don't have that confidence, um, if it's not ingrained in your mental framework that you the GOAT, that you are that person, you, that you are that person, things will end well. Um, things change in my life when 
I realize that life doesn't revolve around this person or that person. It revolves around me. It's a selfish mindset, but when you come from a mindset of people pleasing, you have to be selfish. It's it's the time and place for everything. And I feel like, um, you know, personal traumas in your life, it's the time you just have to like shed it, shed it away and become the true person that you that you are, you know, that's hidden under a persona that you think is um, socially acceptable. At a certain point in life, you have to say, you know, forget society, but I still have to use society for status. Um, I won't let society dictate what's cool. I make what's cool, but at the end of the day, society is, you know, civilization is you know there's still rules to everything it's still it's still it's always gonna be a hierarchy always gonna be you know it's always gonna be somebody that's doubting you and use that for motivation um i ain't even want this to turn to a deep a deep little talk i just got got the rambling but Yeah, I'm finna uh, clear this other one out, put the other one back in. But yeah, this uh, solo plan life. What is it, August 9th? Yeah, I think about every week it's gonna be a little short, a video and a short that I'm gonna release every week. Just one, cause doing it every day, just trying to water stuff every day that wasn't hidden. That was making my plants really brown. So yeah. Thanks for watching.